from the beginning of my mandate, which was uh, three years ago, I have uh, recognized that the prevention and the uh, elimination of torture in our time uh, requires you know, not only multidisciplinary efforts, but also coordinated and, uh, and well uh, synergized efforts among many different institutions. Uh, the United Nations certainly cannot uh, do it alone. And I think in that sense, um, the OSCE, uh, especially with its insistence on uh, the creation of national preventing, preventive mechanisms uh, against torture in each of its member countries, plays a very large role. I think it's uh, very important for regional organizations, including OSCE, um, to uh, coordinate with us and, and us to coordinate with them, of course, in, for example, uh, knowing when we need to visit a country, uh, opening channels of communication with governments that uh, ignore our, our requests, and, and the OSCE may be in a better position to uh, put us in touch with the uh, authorities that would invite us uh, to, to visit the country. But more important than that, uh, I think uh, we should coordinate on how to conduct follow-up on the recommendations that we make to states. Uh, in the, on the part of the United Nations, we are very interested in follow-up if we visit a country and write a report and afterwards nothing happens, we really have uh, wasted our time. I also think that uh, regional organizations, in, including the OSCE, would be very helpful in following up on thematic reports. And by that I mean, you know, uh, I do two thematic reports a year, one to the Human Rights Council and the other one to the General Assembly. Uh, and they generate some discussion at the time, but um, it's very important that they don't disappear or die out after we present them. And uh, one way to do it is to generate discussion beyond the report to the Human Rights Council and the General Assembly. And for that, it would be very important to, to have uh, uh, the support of the OSCE. And finally, I would say OSCE is especially important in generating um, emphasis on the creation of national preventive mechanisms uh, in each state. Uh, I think the OSCE has taken a lead on that and it's a, a good um, example for other regional organizations. We all think about cooperation and we, and we try to cooperate, but it's not always easy because we then go off and we're very busy with whatever we're doing. So uh, opportunities like this one uh, are important to my mandate, to the Rapporteurship on Torture, uh, because it gives us a chance to, uh, to plan cooperation with regional organizations like the OSCE.